So how do you get a leader on a fly line? The easiest way is most fly lines come with a permanent loop on the end. So there's a loop there on your fly line and there's a loop on the end of your leader. All you do is take the leader and you pass the leader over the line loop and then you pass your leader through the line loop like so. You pull it through, all the way through, and then you just close the loop. Sometimes you have to kind of give that, that knot a little, a little poke. You have to push it up a little bit. And then you're left with a beautiful square knot, which is very, very secure. And if you need to change a leader, it's very easy to just back that off and pull the leader back through. Let's say you don't have a permanent loop on your fly line. Maybe your fly line didn't come with one, or sometimes those permanent loops after years of use will, will kind of wear out and the core will start to get exposed and you have to replace them. So you can put a leader directly onto your fly line, but you want to use a nice clean knot that's going to go through your guides and is not going to affect your casting. So to tie a nail knot, you're going to need a uh, a little special tool. They have tools on some knives or you can get a tool to tie a nail knot or you can just use a very thin diameter tube, a small metal tube. Uh, even the uh, inside of a, a ballpoint pen will work, but you need a, you need a small rigid tube to tie it. And um, here's how to tie that nail knot. So this is fine, but it's a permanent connection. Your leader is always on there. And if you always use the same leader and you just modify the other end of the leader, that's fine. But if you're gonna change leaders, maybe change leader lengths or something, uh, then this could be a pain because you have to keep tying nail knots. And honestly, a nail knot isn't the easiest thing in the world to tie, believe me. So there's another way of doing this so that you can change leaders quickly. All you need to do is take about a uh, couple feet of uh, either leader butt section material or about 50 pound monofilament and tie a perfection loop in the end of this piece. And now you've got a permanent loop on the end of your fly line. Now I can just attach leader and I can change leaders anytime I want. So I've gotten away from having to tie a nail knot every time I change leaders.